A man eating chicken? A lot of people ask me, can you use two words to make one adjective? Or can you use a noun as an adjective? Or a verb as an adjective? The answer is yes. And today, I want to teach you how. Hello, I'm Darren, and welcome back to Go English. In today's video, I want to talk about compound adjectives. This is when we take two words and we put them together to make one adjective to tell about a noun. These kinds of adjectives are called compound adjectives. And there are different ways to use them. An example might be a man eating chicken. Now, if we don't put a hyphen or a dash in between man and eating, it just means there's a man eating chicken. But if we use the dash between man and eating, that means a chicken that eats a man or people. A chicken that will eat people. So, a man eating chicken. Ah! Man eating chicken. Uh, some other examples might be, she is a world famous singer. There are some common types. There are the kind that tell us about periods of time. This would be a number plus a length of time. For example, I have a two hour class tomorrow, or it's a five week course, or a 10 year war. But you should know that we never pluralize the length of time. It's always two hour, not two hours. Five year, not five years. Similarly, we can use a number plus a singular noun, like a five story building or a 100 page book. We can also use an adjective plus a noun. For example, a last minute decision, a high quality suit, or a long distance phone call, or an adjective plus a present participle verb. For example, she is a good looking woman. He is an easygoing guy. It's a nice smelling perfume. Or a noun plus a present participle verb. It's a time saving app. Or they live in a Spanish speaking country. It was a record breaking jump. Another one would be a noun plus an adjective. An ice cold drink or a smoke-free environment. A noun plus past participle. For example, sun-dried tomatoes or water-cooled computer. You can use an adverb plus past participle verb. For example, it is a well-lit room or he is a highly respected professor. And finally, you can use an adjective plus a past participle verb. For example, an old fashioned chair or a short lived career. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like and subscribe so you don't miss any upcoming videos. In the comments section below, I'd love to hear a compound adjective that you made. If you learned something from this video, be sure to check out this one. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.